Okay, so this is an Aosmith water heater. This is before it gets the port adapter. So these are the two items that are going to be mailed to the customer, the Aosmith port adapter and the Skycentrics module, Wi-Fi module. So this is all they have to do. They take a Phillips head screwdriver. They unscrew this piece of plastic. Before that, they've made sure to turn it off. Right now, the water heater is off, okay? Then they take the plastic off like this. That's all it took right here. Now they take the port adapter, plug it in. The port adapter comes with two screws. The screws are long. They stick them in like this, stick them in like this. Then they screw down the screws. Okay. As they're doing that, they're getting their Skycentric CTA 2045 module ready. They plug it in like this. They put in the screws. All right, these are hand tightening screws, so they can just do this. And at the very end, if they wanna give it a little touch with a screwdriver, they can tighten it briefly, but by hand is fine also. Now they're ready to power up the water heater, which they do like this. You can see right away there's a pink light that's going to be appearing here. And um, it'll be solid pink. And solid pink will mean it's factory reset. And blue means it's connected. We're gonna factory reset this in part two and show you how to go through the provisioning process, but that was the hardware installation process.